So, I'm sitting here thinking, my content kind of sucks. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy. BMAC. And I know what you're thinking. Come on, BMAC, your videos don't actually suck. Which is true. My videos don't suck, in the sense that they don't suck in the suckiest of all sucks. But they still kinda suck. Which sucks. But what I'm trying to say is that sometimes you gotta just look at your content as a creator and say to yourself, okay, right now, my content kinda sucks. And I say that because right now that's kinda what I'm doing. I'm kind of in the process of trying to make my content the most anti-suck that it could be. As you guys know, I recently reached 100,000 subscribers on this YouTube channel, which is amazing, incredible. There she is. Woohoo! Emotions go running. The love and support you've shown me has been unfathomable. And I've said multiple times now on my social media channels how 100,000 YouTube subscribers really just means this is the beginning of something even bigger. And what I mean by that is that it's time to take my career to places it's never been before. And in order to do that, I started to look at my YouTube channel analytics here on this channel and noticed that my numbers all, for the most part, have pretty much dropped a little bit. Now I'm sure some of that has to do with algorithm changes and probably some older successful videos that are now being outperformed by newer, more relevant videos. As well as probably not uploading and publishing to this channel as much as I would like to. But one thing about YouTube analytics is that they could only tell you so much. After looking at my analytics, I've taken some notes. I know some things I have to do to make my numbers better and to make this channel better. And I've already started implementing those changes. But sometimes the one thing better than drooling over your analytics is actually just taking a step back to talk to you guys directly. So I guess you can consider this my 2019 spring cleaning on this channel. Well, in a way, it's not like we're gonna be cleaning anything. I'm not deleting anything. Also, my stuff is pretty well organized, so I won't be organizing anything. I guess I'm basically just gonna be dusting, dusting up a little bit. Okay, this simile didn't go the way I planned it to, but you get the point. What I would like to do is dust up on my video creation process, dust up on the flow of my actual video content, and dust up on the actual content strategy that I'm implementing. Because sometimes you get so caught up in the creation process as a creator, that you start to forget the little things. And the best way to remember those little things is by talking to you guys, the audience, each and every single one of you viewers. Because you're the reason why I do what I do and you're the reason how I'm able to do what I do. So I wanted to make this quick little video opening up the floor to you guys to see, you know, how you been, but also to directly ask you for some feedback on this channel. So if you have a few minutes, maybe a pen and paper nearby as well. I've got a few questions for you that I would love to hear your answers to in the comment section below. So without any further ado, let me ask you some questions. First up, let me start by asking you guys what you would like to see more of on this channel. If you were to visit this channel tomorrow and the next day, maybe the day after that, what are some different specific videos you'd like to see published on this channel? Maybe you have some ideas for videos or some requests for videos. Spill all of your ideas and requests in the comment section. You might actually see some of them turn in to an actual video on this channel. And then question number two, how do you feel about the way I'm delivering content on this channel? Do you like the B-roll I've been including Lately? Would you like to see more of that B-roll? Maybe you would like to see less of that B-roll and more of me? This pretty little face, I almost just poked my eye out. Are my videos too long? Are my videos too short? Am I talking too fast? Am I talking too slow? Also, super important here, how do you find out about my new videos? Are you subscribed with notifications turned on so you receive a notification? Or maybe you're subscribed with notifications turned on and you don't receive a notification? Do you just happen to see a new video in your feed when you visit YouTube? Or do you follow me on Twitter and Instagram and look for a new video announcement there? Comment the answer to those down below. Big one here, please do not hold back, trust me. I could take the heat. What do you love or hate about my videos? This kind of builds on the last question about how I'm actually delivering content, but I guess it deserves its own little section because it's very important. If you love something about my channel, about my videos, flatter me. If you hate something about my channel or my videos, tear me apart, do it, make me cry. Well, don't actually make me cry, but don't hold back. As long as you have constructive feedback, I could handle the criticism. And then speaking of Twitter and Instagram from the other question, question number four, do you follow me 
on Twitter and Instagram. Now don't worry, I'm not calling you out here if you don't. I'm just trying to figure out the value you're expecting from each different social media platform. So if you follow me on either Instagram or Twitter, why did you follow me and is there something you were expecting from follow me that you're getting or not getting? Is there a certain kind of content you were expecting on Twitter or Instagram that you're either getting or not getting? Or if you're not following me on Twitter or Instagram, what would make you wanna follow me? Let your boy know. And then lastly, what are you getting out of this channel that you like or what are you not getting out of this channel that you wish you were? In other words, did you subscribe to this channel for a reason and you're happy to have that reason fulfilled or did you subscribe and you're watching this video kind of wondering why you did subscribe because you're not getting something you were expecting? Is there a certain kind of content you love and you wish you were getting more of or are you kind of bored with a certain kind of content that you keep seeing on this channel? When it comes to subscribing to this channel, comment in the comment section below whether you're happy or not happy that you did. Let me know if this channel is fulfilling your content needs or if it's not fulfilling your content needs, what could help it do so? Basically what I would like you guys to do here is just go nuts in the comment section, leave all the feedback you want to. Hashtag no filter, except you don't need to curse. Don't start cursing, that won't be necessary. But besides that, hashtag no filter, let me know your thoughts. This way I could figure out more from you guys without diving deeply into analytics for answers that I probably won't be able to find anyway. Analytics can't tell me your guys' individual thoughts and feelings about this channel. They could only go so far. But at the end of the day, as always, thank you so much for your support on this channel. I know my videos don't actually suck, that's probably why you're watching this one, but sometimes as a creator, you have to convince yourself that the bar is no longer as high as you'd like it to be, so that you could actually raise it higher, make your content even better, make it that much more anti-suck. So that way you could raise the bar and your content will no longer suck. At least in, you know, the creator's eyes. That's just the way I'm looking at it here. Hopefully you see what I'm going with. Comment all your thoughts and feelings below. I'll probably read each and every single one of them because your feedback is actually very important and helpful to me. And I just love talking to you guys too. So that's a plus. In the meantime, I've got my tissues ready here for those of you who are not gonna hold back because I know some people are gonna go absolutely off, tear me apart, get the tissues ready. I'll see you guys in my next video. JK, I'm not actually gonna cry reading some mean criticizing feedback. I might actually, it's possible, probably not. Although some haters out there really know how to get you going.